Welcome to Fantasy Audiobook, Lord of the People. I set off a frenzy of plant alienation. Chapter 81 Early morning, Susie gently removed the pair of jade arms that were around her, and at the same time put aside the little goblin who was pressing on her body. As dawn breaks, the goblin just came back from outside. As soon as he came back, he sensibly got into Susie's bed and hugged him to sleep. Susie stood up straight, looking at the cute expression on the little fairy's sleepy face. It was discovered that the little goblin had unknowingly advanced again, and the energy fluctuations on her body had increased. I used an appraisal technique on the goblin, and a set of information appeared in front of me. Open black lens bracket little fairy close black lens bracket. Race. Fairy. Quality. Legend. Grade. 61. Constitution. 26,000. X. 320000. 680000. Skills. Natural growth prompting plants, speeding up the growth speed of plants, self-healing light wherever the area is, the partner's recovery speed plus 61%, the light of endurance the area where the partner is located, the partner's stamina plus 61%, speed light in its area, companion speed plus 61%. Loyalty. 100% permanent. Introduction. I am already a qualified nanny. Looking at the various data of the little goblin, Su Luo pondered. Natural light is used to speed up plant growth. The light of self-healing, the light of endurance, and the light of speed are buffs for all-round enhancement of combat power of other heroes. 61% self-healing, endurance, speed enhancement. Undoubtedly, it will make Suzy's troops and hero combat power to a higher level. As expected of a nanny, all skills are top-notch and support. Suzy reached out and rubbed the pretty face of the goblin. The little fairy opened her sleepy eyes and found that Susie was looking at her, and her delicate body pressed Susie. Owner, sniffing the smell of Susie. Looking up at Susie, the corners of her mouth slightly turned up, her beautiful eyes looked at Susie with tenderness like water. 10 o'clock in the morning. Susie dressed in white and walked out of the messy lord's mansion. This time he experienced the new skills of the goblin. Although it is much stronger than before, it is only the seventh rank after all. It can't compare to the ninth order Suzy. My lord, good morning. A cute voice came from beside him, Suzy looked towards him. It's Chi Chi. When she saw Chi Chi's clothes, she immediately boxed her glasses. A light white suit vest with a red tie on the outside. The lower body is wearing a pleated skirt, mentioned at the waist. There is a layer of snow-white white silk knee socks on the legs, and a pair of black shiny ladies leather shoes under the feet. The two furry ears on the head shake from time to time. Coupled with Chi-Chi's petite figure and cute face. A pure, lovely feeling arises spontaneously, which is eye-catching. There is a refreshing feeling. The most important thing is her chest that is almost coming out of the collar, which is jaw-dropping. The little girl is not tall, but she is unexpectedly good-looking. My lord, being looked at by Susie like this, Chi-Chi was a little shy, she lowered her head, a blush appeared on her pretty face. Slightly surprised, fairy sister is right, the lord likes girls to dress like this. After being told by Chi-Chi, Susie quickly turned his head. In my heart, I was a little surprised. When we met for the first time, Chi-Chi is still a disgraced Cinderella. Now wash up, change clothes. It's like a completely changed person turned into a pure and lovely white swan. Good morning, Susie greeted with a smile. During the brief sage moment, Susie has no desire for Chi-Chi for the time being. As for the future, tell you later, it's all meat in a bowl, where else can it go? Susie asked her, it's so early in the morning, what are you doing here? Chi-Chi heard the words, looking up at the sky, it was almost noon. But she still replied, I came to find Sister Fairy, she said that she would accompany me to plant spiritual plants today. But I couldn't wait for her, so I came to her. Last night, I was stunned by the three heroes. Chi-Chi didn't dare to mention it to Suzy, for fear that the Lord would laugh at her. She is asleep now, let me go with you. Suzy waved his hand and said awkwardly. The little goblin wanted to say something just now, but at the time she was in a mood of excitement, so she blocked her mouth and didn't let her say it. It seems to be Chi Chi's matter. Suzy looked into the distance. The vast spiritual field in the distance is already full of working rabbit people. Both young and old work in the fields. 
Su Zi nodded secretly, very satisfied with the rabbitman. If you are tired, you can let your clansmen rest for a while, there is no rush to cultivate the spiritual field, there is a lot of time. Su Zi walked and said to Chi Chi. The 4,000 square kilometer spiritual field cannot be reclaimed in a short period of time. It seems that it is time to recruit more good-looking races. Su Zi thought in his heart. Yes, my lord, I will tell everyone. Seeing that the lord is concerned about the rabbit people, he is very relieved. Their rabbit people are now completely dependent on the lord. Su Zi can't be dissatisfied with their rabbit people. At this time, Xiao Ju galloped down from a distance, and bowed slightly to Su Zi. My lord, the map within a radius of 10,000 miles has been drawn, and the territory within it has also been marked. Then, she handed Su Zi a pair of parchment. Su Zi was very pleasantly surprised when he heard the words, and praised Xiao Ju. Thanks for your hard work. Xiao Ju's leaves shook, and seeing that Su Zi didn't give any more orders, he flew directly under the world tree to practice his sword. Su Zi opened the parchment directly. Parchment, the surrounding terrain, mineral veins, mountains and rivers have been clearly marked. I didn't expect Xiao Ju to have a talent for drawing. Su Zi smiled slightly, then he turned his gaze to the place where the red dot was highlighted. Su Zi took a glance, and these were all the lords, territories with a radius of thousands of miles. There are 29 in total. There is also a reason why Su Zi asked Xiao Ju to collect the positions of the lords with a radius of thousands of miles. According to the information obtained from World Channel, the speed at which a local territory absorbs source points and source crystals is also related to the number of lords in an area. The more lords there are, the less each lord will be allocated. Su Zi naturally didn't want other lords to share his interests here. Here, it is enough to have him alone. In the southeast of the mainland, many lords descended. Su Zi plans to expand the sphere of influence of his territory step by step. If he can occupy the southeast region alone, the number of source crystals and source points produced every day will inevitably increase dramatically. In this way, the territory can also be upgraded as soon as possible. Certainly, all of this is built on a strong foundation. Open the Big Rock Desert Regional Channel. The night passed. There have been a lot of messages here, most of which are newly arrived lords. Brothers, do you have any way to increase the speed at which the territory absorbs source crystals and source points? There is no shortage of source crystals, but there are more than a dozen source points every day. If you want to accumulate enough source points to become a god, you have to wait until the year of the monkey. Don't worry, wait until the world battlefield opens, as long as you kill enough aliens, there will be so many sources that you can hardly imagine 06. The most difficult thing to get is the power of faith. It is too difficult for those subjects to develop faith. Now add a little bit of faith every day. I gave them all my heart and soul, and that's what they paid me back. I wanted to kill them all. Quote. Hee hee, don't you, didn't you learn it in school? To those affiliated races, you need to be kind and powerful, and you can do it both ways. They are living races, not objects. That's right, it's not that simple to gain faith. I don't know if you have noticed, but the monsters in the wild seem to have disappeared overnight, and there were no monster attacks last night. I don't know what happened. I also found out after you said that. I came early. There were monsters attacking the territory every night before, but only last night there was no monster. Brothers, big news. I just sent people to investigate the demon lairs and found that all the demon lairs have been cleaned up. The demon lairs in the entire dashi desert with a radius of thousands of miles were cleaned up overnight. Damn it, all the devil's lairs within 10,000 miles, which boss made it? Isn't it too violent? Is there such a powerful lord near us? It's not good. I heard that the boss of the plant department of Vermilion Bird, Suzy, is in the southeast corner of the mainland. Did he kill him? As soon as this remark came out, the message time paused for a full minute. Well, is it too late for us to run now? What are you afraid of? Isn't he just a Suzy? How many units does he have? Plants. As long as he dares to come to me, I will get him. Yes, no matter how strong the plant department is, how strong can it be? You are afraid of him, but I am not. Let him come to me if you have the courage. Seeing this, Su Zi frowned. These two guys are brave. Or what you just said. So I typed directly below and sent it up.
Wait, I'll be right there. Then Susie thought about it, and posted the other party's coordinates on it. Open black lens bracket flaming Pegasus collar close black lens bracket. Ma can has frivolous eyebrows, sitting on a fiery red flying horse, supervising cats and men working in the fields, his brows are full of pride. He is different from those who are afraid of Susie. He himself is the genius of the purple panel, Pegasus. He even got the legendary unit bestowed by the family, Flaming Pegasus. Mighty fighting force. Although his reputation was not obvious during the trial, it was just that he kept a low profile. With the help of the family. In a short period of time, the territory was promoted to the ninth rank lord. The purpose is to show their talents on the endless continent and win a good name. And yesterday he happened to learn that. Susie who has been in the limelight in the endless continent recently. It was not far from the area where he was. Is there anything easier to gain fame than stepping on a Tianzhou? So, he did not hesitate to spend Yuanjing to speak on the regional channel, the purpose is to let Suzy see. It's not just that Suzy dislikes being too crowded around. He also thinks so. Big rock desert, one lord is enough. When he kills Suzy, then it will attack other leaders. For this, he will not be merciful in the slightest, which god is not killed out of endless geniuses. Do you really think becoming a god is that easy? That's just the accumulation of endless years. Compared to the gods, more lords are just submerged in the vast river of history. Suzy, for him, it is just a slightly larger stepping stone. Sure enough, when he watched the regional channel again. Then I saw the reply from Suzy. Suzy, wait, I'll be right there. Puff, ha ha ha. I really hope you come here soon, my 8th level flame Pegasus can't wait. Ma Chan laughed loudly, when they learned that Suzy was kidnapped by an unknown person. Would you be surprised after killing it? Ma Khan was looking forward to it. Then, he saw the address sent by Suzy. Frowned slightly. How did he know he was here? But then I don't care. Hope you don't disappoint me. The corners of Ma Khan's mouth were slightly raised, looking at the sky, suddenly the corners of his mouth twitched. I heard you were looking for me. I'm here right now. How is it? Isn't it slow? Suzy stood in the air with his hands behind his back, and said calmly to the lord below. One is eighth rank, three is seventh rank. The four heroes lined up one by one, overlooking the bottom. When Yan, Ma Kan's pupils shrank, Suzy came so fast, but when he saw clearly that Susie had brought only four strange-looking soldiers, he couldn't help but smile. He didn't know what gave Susie such confidence. How dare you bring only four heroes? And came to attack his territory. Is it inflated by being promoted by outsiders? Can't recognize myself anymore. Then he might step on the throne of his royal highness led by Vermilion Bird today. Think of this. Ma Kan's eyes burst into a ray of cold light. The 8th level hero Lai Yan Tian Ma Wang understood, and his two pairs of iron hooves braving red flames piled into the void. People have already flown into the sky. Treat Su Zi as an equal. At the same time, from the collar of the Raging Flame Heavenly Horse, 408th Order Raging Flame Heavenly Palaces flew out. These Pegasus horses are strong and red all over. The four iron hooves and the bright red flames on the fur on the neck are burning and rolling. From a distance, it looks very handsome. Suzy looked at the Pegasus under the strong man. Open black lens bracket fire Pegasus king close black lens bracket. Race. Pegasus. Quality. Legendary. Heroic. Grade. 77. Physique. 560,000. X. 780000. 470000. Skills. Flame 9 steps. Flame slash. Flame vortex. Flame impact. Flame Storm, Flame Rain. Introduction. The royal family of the Tianma family, Flame Pegasus. Be careful with its flame, it can kill people. Suzy was a little surprised. This is the first time he has encountered a legendary hero. Can't help being a little curious. How many moves can he make with the nine leaf sword grass? When Suzy was looking at the Flame Pegasus, Ma can also use the identification technique on Suzy's forearms. Don't look at his proud appearance. But how could he, who came from a big family, the Ma family, despise the enemy? In fact, he looks rough, but in fact he is delicate, even cautious. However, when he saw the identified information, he was stunned. 
Open black lens bracket 9 leaf sword grass close black lens bracket. Race. Plant. Quality. Grade. Constitution. Agile. Spirit. Colon question mark question mark question mark. Introduction. Still watching. Watch again. I'll kill you. What kind of weird information is this? Ma can is numb. In addition to the name and race, he did not identify anything. And a final introduction. He had never encountered such a weird introduction, as if the plant was warning him with the introduction. How is this possible? Ma Khan shook his head, and deleted a trace of terrible conjecture from his mind. He then looked at the other three arms. Turns out, again, only their names and races are known. There is no extra information. Not only did he frown slightly, he suspected that Susie used some method to cover up the information. Thinking of this, not only did he heave a sigh of relief, he intentionally showed a provocative expression and said to Suzy, You are Suzy. My name is Ma Can. I thought you have superpowers. You look very ordinary. Talking room. Ma Can's hundreds of eighth rank flame Pegasus horses have already surrounded Su Shang and the others. All of them stared at them vigilantly. Suzy didn't panic either, his face remained calm and composed. Spreading his hands to Ma Can, he smiled and said, if you mean appearance, then I think I can play quite well. I've never seen anything comparable to mine, if you can't see. All I can say is that you are blind. Quote, hearing this, the corner of Ma Can's mouth twitched. The first time I saw such a narcissistic person. Although Suzy has indeed grown a good skin, this is not the age of relying on appearance. Strength is the root of everything. I don't know if your strength can hit like your face. Ma Can smiled, unwilling to say more. Now that Suzy has already called to his door, then how could he not return the gift? Next moment, Ma Khan has already flown into the air, standing tens of feet away from Suzy. I really don't know where you got the courage to come here to act wildly with only four arms. Don't you take me seriously, Ma Khan? Ma Khan smiled ferociously, showing his big teeth. Wave slightly, all the blazing Pegasus will have to move. You will know later, you each play with them. Suzy scattered the four heroes, each looking for an opponent. Nine Leaf Sword Grass stopped the hero Lai Yan Tian Ma Wang. The catfish tree and the parasitic spores each stopped a hundred Li Yantian horses. Shen Liu, the most physically built, enveloped 208th rank raging flame Pegasus by himself. See, Ma Kan looked at Suzy with a slight mockery in his eyes. I thought you were someone, but I didn't expect you to be so big. You actually want your troops to be defeated by one against a hundred. Ha ha ha, what do you think of my Pegasus Pegasus? He is a legendary soldier. Good. Can't help but say. The two sides fought directly together. The two lords Ma Ken and Suzy looked at each other from a distance. This is generally the case in battles between lords. If you can't destroy the core of the opponent's territory, then it is useless to fight the opponent's lord. So when the lords meet, they all fight with their heroes and arms. Until the arms of one side are completely dead. Behind the boulders in the distance. A man with a sharp mouth and monkey cheeks is silently watching the two people in the sky. When I saw that Suzy really only had four troops. His face darkened. Originally, he thought that the two would fight until the end, and then he would stand up and take advantage of it. But I didn't expect the rumored Suzy. It seems that there is no difference except for the outstanding appearance. The rumors are wrong. Suzy, you will regret your recklessness in no time. Ma Khan said to Suzy with a smile, with strong confidence in his words. Really, I'm looking forward to it. Suzy also smiled back. Ma Chan frowned. He really didn't know where Suzy's confidence came from. It is also a legendary weapon. Even if the giant dragon came, it would not dare to say that one is against a hundred. But Suzy still came. Flame Vortex. Ma Chan waved his hand. The Flame Sky Horse King and hundreds of Flame Sky Horses opened their mouths together. Hundreds of raging flames with a diameter of 2 meters and a width of 2 meters swirled and spewed out from the mouth of the raging Flame Sky Horse. The air instantly became hot. The blazing fire seemed to ignite the air. This is the sky fire condensed by the 8th rank raging flame Pegasus. It is enough to burn everything, and once contaminated, it cannot be extinguished until the enemy is burned to ashes. Hundreds of intense flames directly covered the four heroes in billowing flames. 
This is your type of arms. It seems very ordinary. Seeing Su Zi's four armies trapped in flames, a bright smile appeared on Ma Chan's face. Originally, thought it would take some energy. But he remembered. Su Zi is the lord of the plant department, and his pegasus perfectly restrained his plants. Not urgent. Su Zi was very calm, without any anxiety on his face. Since his heroes have been promoted to the seventh rank, Su Zi found out, they seem to have acquired new properties. For example, Fire Rabbit, for example, ZK. When the blazing fire goes out, Ma can look towards Su Zi's several arms, and his face suddenly showed horror. How can there be nothing? That is an eighth level attack. Even if the giant dragon is hit by so many vortexes of flames, it will peel off its skin if it doesn't die. Ma Kan's eyes widened in disbelief. But Su Zi's arms are still intact, as if nothing happened. How is this possible? But the facts were in front of him, and he couldn't allow him to refute. Man watching from afar, he was also shocked by Su Zi's arms, frowned and muttered to himself. How, Aga, did he do it? It didn't hurt at all. It seems that they might really be able to fight for both sides. Thinking of this, the man couldn't help but get worried. Su Zi obviously wasn't in the mood to answer him. It's my turn. Su Zi smiled slightly at Ma Kan, the smile was as bright as Ma Kan before. Next moment, the four heroes seemed to be ordered. He aimed his eyes at his prey. A breeze blows by. Xiao Ju moved. Nine to three meter long leaves emit a slight green light. Then the nine blades frantically swept towards the flame Pegasus King. Nine sharp blades, like the nine sharpest swords. While waving, one after another is extremely terrifying, the sword energy that seems to split the space crazily cuts towards the enemy. The other side, the catfish tree also moved. She N. Highlights. Overtake. The pomo tree let out two sinister and ear-piercing mocking sounds, and the two eyes on the trunk were bent into crescent shapes. Then slightly shake the white crown above the head. Countless beautiful dandelions floated towards the hundreds of pegasus in front of them as if they had eyes. Shen Liu is still expressionless, but she began to exude holy and dazzling light all over her body, like the holy spirit who fell into the world. Holy splendor shines all around. Instantly enveloped 208th rank pegasus. Palm-sized parasitic spores swaying vigorous stamens. Numerous pollen-like particles instantly filled the surroundings. In a short time, then it merged into the bodies of dozens of raging flame pegasus, and then directly entered their bodies. When no one finds out, the spirits of these blazing ponies began to dissipate, being taken over by alien spores. The show has begun. Seeing this scene, Susie was also full of curiosity. This was the first time he saw the three heroes make a move. How amazing will it be? Really. Next moment, countless sword lights directly enveloped Li Yantian Horse King. Almost instantly, numerous wounds appeared directly on Li Yan Tianma's body, each of which was deeply visible to the bone. Ah, the flame sky horse king uttered a painful cry. The flames on his hoof exploded instantly, and he frantically messed around in the air. Want to escape the overbearing sword attack? Seeing this scene, Ma Kan's face changed instantly. And this is just the beginning. Next moment, the dandelion from the demonic dandelion tree landed on the flame pegasus. Ah, quote exclamation mark quote, ow, almost every pegasus was stained with several, even dozens of pure white dandelions. Then these dandelions seemed to take root, crazy inhaling everything about Tianma. Blood, flesh, soul. Li Yantian Ma felt the heart-piercing pain. This, what's going on? Seeing this scene, Ma Kan was a little flustered for a moment. He cast his eyes on the sacred willow. As a result, he was so scared that he almost fell from the sky. I saw 208th rank flame Pegasus horses illuminated by the light of the divine willow. All of them knelt down in front of Shen Liu. The noble head in the past is deeply lowered at this time. It's like worshipping that huge willow tree. Unwillingly, he looked at the little one at the end but he was dumbfounded again. A hundred flaming pegasus. Half of them are madly attacking their partners at this time. The flame skills poured out desperately one by one. The other half still haven't figured out why the companion just now. Suddenly attacking myself frantically, overwhelmed by the crazy attack. What's going on here? How could it be? Ma Kan was stunned. For a short time, 
The entire battlefield changed its appearance, a complete reversal. Man watching from afar, eyes wide open swallowed. It feels like the three views have been refreshed today. Can plants be so perverted? From the appearance of Suzy, the two sides started the war until the end of the war. The time did not exceed five minutes. It can be said. It's a crushing level Lord War. From the moment the nine-leaf sword grass started, there was no wish. Suzy was extremely satisfied with the performance of several heroes. Although the three heroes have not been summoned for a long time, their combat effectiveness is top-notch. Three supreme heroes, even at the legendary level, it can crush the enemy with a crushing posture. The real one can be called invincible at the same level. Moreover, these heroes all have extremely terrifying potential and strength. Even after Su Zi becomes a god in the future, they can also be called the most powerful gods under Su Zi. To expand the territory of Su Zi's gods and crush the heavens. It really shows the terrifying strength of the plant system. All kinds of thoughts about the four heroes flash in my heart. Su Zi looked at Ma Kan. At this time, Ma Kan's face was full of fear, his fists were clenched tightly, and his whole body was already wet with cold sweat. Looking at Su Zi, he seemed to be looking at a demon, a devil. He has never seen such a strange type of arms. Like the grass of the swordsman, the weird dandelion, the deceptive willow, and the spore that can control the arms. He felt that what happened today was full of absurdity. The legendary hero he is proud of. There is no resistance in front of the plant department. The difference between the two. It's like a cloud of mud. All of his hundreds of arms and heroes are no match for Suzy's four major arms. He didn't know how much strength Suzy still had, and he didn't show it. But now he has lost, completely lost. But he didn't want to die. What to do? Ma Khan was sweating in cold sweat. Su, Suzy, I can become your subordinate lord, I can fight for you, can you let me go? Ma Khan stuttered and asked. Sweat trickled down his majestic body, obviously very nervous. Hee <laughs> hee, didn't you just say that I would regret it? Why are you begging for mercy now? Suzy smiled lightly and asked Ma Shan jokingly. This person can bend and stretch, with a rough appearance, but a delicate mind. How could he let him go? Even a lord knows how to cut grass and roots. As for becoming a sub-lord, ah, he still can't see each other. A lord who can't bring him any use, what use does he have? Seeing Su Zi's appearance, I felt a scene in my heart. He understood that Su Zi didn't let go of his intentions, and immediately stopped admitting cowardice. Su Zi, my own sister is currently serving as the Twelve Protectors in the White Tiger League. She has a high position and authority. You don't want to be an enemy of the White Tiger League, do you? I can pay for my life, and I promise that I will never be an enemy of you in the future. Ma Khan began to threaten faintly, this is his reliance. He hoped that Suzy would be able to retreat despite difficulties. At the same time, put down your figure, saying that you can spend money to buy your life. White Tiger League, I haven't heard of it. Suzy was puzzled. I already understood Ma Khan's plan in my heart. If you want to throw a mouse trap yourself, don't shoot him. But how is it possible? You have already offended, are you still waiting for the other party to become stronger to take revenge? Threat, you'd better die. Suzy's face turned cold, and without saying a word, he slapped Ma Khan directly. A hundred times the power of the ninth level. In an instant, the space that was opened was shattered. Ma Khan didn't even react. It was directly turbulent by the shattered space, devouring not even the dregs left. But Suzy knew. The opponent is not dead yet. Suzy disappeared from the spot in a flash. Next moment, the person appeared directly in front of the sculpture in the center of the flame pegasus territory. This is a stone sculpture of a flying horse with wings spread out and about to step into the blue sky. Cat people around, seeing that the invincible lord in the past was killed in a short period of time. Hiding in houses one by one trembling. A few bold ones only dared to reveal a little gap, watching Su Zi worriedly. Worried about him killing a lot. Please, don't, don't destroy the core of my territory. Sculpture. Ma Khan's floating soul begged for mercy. Don't be my enemy again in the next life. Su Zi shook his head, stretched out a finger, slightly on the sculpture's head. The core of the territory is under the panic of the soul. Cracks spread rapidly from top to bottom. Boom. 
the sculpture eventually collapsed into pieces and scattered all over the place. At the same time, a message prompt appeared in front of Susie's eyes. Congratulations on successfully destroying the core of Flaming Pegasus territory. Territory, the rate at which your territory absorbs source crystals and source points is plus 100%. Congratulations on getting 1 million source crystals from Ma Can. Oh, Susie raised his eyebrows and sighed in his heart. The sons of these families are rich indeed, carrying millions of source crystals with him. This Nima is rich, but now it's mine. Susie smiled slightly and opened the territory message. Open black lens bracket territory close black lens bracket, natural territory. Open black lens bracket affiliation close black lens bracket, Susie. Open black lens bracket grade close black lens bracket, 88. Open black lens bracket area close black lens bracket, 4000 square kilometers. Open black lens bracket architecture close black lens bracket. Open black lens bracket watching pool close black lens bracket. Open black lens bracket city lords mansion close black lens bracket. Open black lens bracket pond close black lens bracket open black lens bracket fan tower. Transformation, 8,000 source crystals per day, 800 source points per day. Open black lens bracket resident close black lens bracket, 35. Power of faith, 45 strands per day zero. The conversion efficiency has indeed doubled, from 4,000 source crystals per day to now 8,000 liquid crystals per day. The source points have also doubled. If I destroy all the territory of the Great Rock Desert, I'm afraid the conversion efficiency will be even faster. Thinking of this, Susie's eyes turned cold. Now, his reasons for attacking those lords are more sufficient. The law of the jungle. If Susie is weak, he may be the one whose territory is broken. At the same time, a warning sound appeared in front of Susie again. Dear Lord, do you want to make the news of your destruction of Raging Flame Heavenly Horse Collar public on the regional channel? Public. Quote, Susie has nothing to hide. Even if Susie doesn't care, it won't take long. The guy who's been watching out there. I'm afraid it will also help Susie inform other lords around. Relying on the hundred times the strength perception of the Ninth Order. Susie had discovered the hidden guy a long time ago, and has been secretly guarding in his heart. But in the end he didn't make a move. Boom. A muffled thunder from the void exploded in the sky. Next moment, the territory below directly shakes the mountains. The Arrow Tower, Lord's Mansion, City Wall, and other buildings below were transformed into models at in an instant. Susie made a big move. These architectural models flew into the hands. Susie took a look, there are quite a few. There are 15 of them. Among them are 10 defensive towers and 5 auxiliary buildings. Rubbish, not even a legendary building. Susie shook his head and put it all away. In fact, this is normal. Where is it like in Susie's territory? Legend has it that buildings are everywhere, and if it spreads out, I'm afraid it will scare a bunch of people. Suddenly, as if sensing something, Susie looked towards his three seventh-tier heroes. The three of them began to emit a faint fluorescence. Susie surprise, this is going to be advanced again. When Susie cared about his hero, Big Rock Desert in the regional channel, suddenly three repeated announcements came out. It directly caused an uproar among the lords of the Great Stone Wasteland. Regional Announcement. Suzy, the Lord of the Natural Realm, successfully destroyed the Flame Pegasus Collar. Close Black Lens Bracket. Regional Announcement. Suzy, the Lord of the Natural Realm, successfully destroyed the Flame Pegasus Collar. Close Black Lens Bracket. Regional Announcement. Suzy, the Lord of the Natural Realm, successfully destroyed the Flame Pegasus Collar. Close Black Lens Bracket. Three announcements in a row. Immediately, the lord in Big Stone Desert was shocked beyond measure. They look up. Susie sent a message ten minutes ago. Immediately felt fear. In just ten minutes, Susie destroyed a territory. How powerful is he? And, that is open black lens bracket flaming pegasus collar close black lens bracket. Lord Ma Khan, who has been one of the overlords of the Great Rock Desert since his arrival. In a short time, he was killed and destroyed the territory. If this is not in the announcement, they even suspected that someone was joking with them. How could it be so fast? Less than 10 minutes. What should we do? Boss Susie won't attack us, will he? 
We are all from the Dashi Desert, can't we get along well together? He he oh six, don't tell me that you don't know the benefits of destroying a territory. How can you get along well with each other? As soon as this remark came out, in the regional channel, there was a moment of silence. Those who are still in the big stone desert at this moment. Either it has just arrived, and the situation is still unclear. Either they are experienced, or have even secretly launched attacks on other lords. But they dare not be like Suzy. Dare to play it openly. Only dare to do it secretly. For fear of being feared by others, they will attack them in groups. They have all obtained huge benefits from the broken territory. The transformation of the territory is doubled, because of the emperor's source crystal. And the rarest building ever. Each one is enough to greatly increase their background, summon and train more arms and heroes. But precisely because of this, they will feel terrified. Once Suzy tasted the sweetness, will it stop attacking other nearby lords? Obviously not. Now, they even regretted why they landed in the Great Rock Desert. With a strong neighbor, they don't sleep well. Edge of the Boulder Desert. Flaming Pegasus. Oh, it's just a waste territory. You don't even have the qualifications to give me Beeman's shoes. On the edge of the Boulder Desert, Han Lee, who was sitting on the thousand-meter-long golden behemoth, smiled disdainfully. Just entered the Big Rock Desert in the southeast corner of the mainland. He is already connected to the channel in this area. Immediately saw the regional announcement. But Suzy's strength is not bad, but I don't know if he will be shocked when I appear in front of him. Thinking of that scene, Han Lee definitely laughed. Legendary arms are also different. Like the flaming horse. It's just the lowest level of legendary arms. How to compare with the mighty behemoth, titan, dragon. Beeman, go, turn around, let's go see our, his royal highness. Ha ha ha. Hearing the words, Beeman below him immediately turned around. Go straight in the direction of Suzy. Wow, sister Yunur, look, his royal highness Suzy just destroyed the territory of, flaming pegasus. It's quite powerful. Bai Mengmeng, who was wearing dark and rebellious short sleeves and a short skirt, said with a smile while holding a loveless rabbit in her arms. Okay, let's go as soon as possible, in case they come after us. Chu Yuyan at the side smiled lightly and shook her head. If you look at the expressions of the two of them, you will find that they look a little tired at this time. Hateful White Tiger League, shamelessly gang fighting, don't let me find a chance for them to be alone. Otherwise, they will have to be killed. Bai Mengmeng waved her little hand angrily, she was really cute. They were halfway here, encountered the domineering White Tiger League. They are a lord alliance formed by the lords of Baihuling. The lords of White Tiger and Vermilion Bird have conflicts. Plus there is often friction between the two territories. Basically, if you encounter them in the Cosmic Sea, you will have to fight them hard. When their identities were revealed. Along the way, he was hunted down by dozens of lords from the White Tiger League and the rank of Purple Tianzhou. The opponent even dispatched two guardians with artifacts. If it weren't for them, they also have artifacts to save their lives. I'm afraid it will be planted. The other major territories are also forming their own alliances. But they are led by Vermilion Bird, but they have no leader. In a short period of time, the loss was heavy. A large number of Vermilion Bird lords were attacked and killed. They come here. It is hoped that Suzy can lead them, form the Vermilion Bird Alliance, and lead them to fight back. The entire Vermilion Bird Caller. He is the only one with such qualifications and strength. Big Brother Cow, Fatty Wong, who also just walked into the Big Rock Desert. His footsteps stopped, his eyes brightened slightly. I have to hurry up and celebrate with my eldest brother. Fatty Wong stopped, thinking about how to give his eldest brother a gift. Only in this way can we gain trust better. 547 Suddenly. He noticed that there seemed to be a territory not far away, and his eyes lit up when he saw the people in that territory clearly. Centaur. A rare species. I don't know if it matches the XP of my brother. But you can try. After Fatty Wong figured it out. Immediately, he took the dwarf holding a double hammer behind him and headed towards the territory. Stop. Beauty. Don't run away. Where can you go if you run again? On a grassland not far from open black lens bracket big stone wasteland close black lens bracket. A group of people led tens of thousands of troops and heroes, chasing a beautiful girl ahead. 
The girl with a stern face in front kept silent and ran all the way towards the big rock desert. Wait, Captain, it seems that there is a big rocky desert ahead, do we still have to chase? Suddenly, a person spoke to the leader at the front. The leader of the alliance once said, let us not enter the great rock desert for the time being. Do you need to report it? The leader looked greedily at the fleeing figure. But think of the reminders from those around you. Ponder a little, we don't want to provoke that guy. Does he dare to be an enemy of our White Tiger League? After all, he chased forward again. The rest of the people also followed into the big rock desert after hearing the words. Too terrifying, Lula, who had been hiding in the distance and observing secretly, turned around resentfully. Originally, I thought that the snipe and the clam would fight and the fishermen would benefit. Unexpectedly, this Susie is even more vicious than rumored. In just a few minutes, then he killed all of Ma Khan's troops. The key is, Susie also sent only four heroes. And, Susie's strength is also extremely terrifying. The same as the Ninth Order. Susie actually slapped Ma Khan to death at the same level. This is simply too strong to be human. Why is everyone a lord, but you are so powerful? Is the plant department really that powerful? He was puzzled. Fortunately, he didn't find me. After returning, we must find a way to check and balance him, otherwise there will be no place for us people to live in the Great Rock Desert. Quote. Lula secretly said, he needs to contact all the lords in the Great Stone Desert. Don't believe it. With so many lords combined, none of them can beat Susie alone. What do you want to do? Suddenly a voice appeared behind him. I think, Lula, who was about to continue talking, felt a twitch in his heart, and then turned his head twitchingly at the corner of his mouth. Sue, boss Susie. I don't want to do anything. Lula smiled wryly in his heart. So you've been peeping. Susie's face was indifferent and looked extremely scary. This man has been spying on him with malicious intentions. I, I just want to. Before Lula finished speaking, he saw a huge slap falling from the sky. Next moment, the badge on Luli's chest flashed slightly, and his people had appeared thousands of meters away. Your uncle, Luli's heart was beating wildly, he didn't expect Susie to attack him suddenly. Hey, you still want to unite with other people to deal with me? He should be another lord talking in the channel. Susie was a little surprised that he escaped his own blow, but he didn't care too much. But he doesn't know, Lu Li's heart is already bleeding. The only piece of purple quality life-saving equipment on him, escape badge. The function is to avoid a fatal attack. But this time it is directly abolished. Suzy, we are not finished, just wait. Without hesitation, Lula turned around and ran away, leaving harsh words at the same time. It's true that it's not over yet, can this still make you run away? Susie chuckled, and the scorching sun guide directly appeared in his hand. Bow, pull the strings, aim, next moment, a golden arrow burning with red flames shoots out, breaking through layers of space in an instant, straight to the back of Luli's head. Lula only felt the heat behind him, then lost consciousness. The whole person was directly pierced by the arrow, and the red golden flame burned blazingly. Soon, Luli's whole body was burned to ashes. See this. The bow and arrow in Susie's hand disappeared. It's not dead yet, but it's coming soon. Let him live a little longer. Susie shook his head and didn't care. At the same time, giant crocodile collar thousands of miles away. Luli's soul was gradually conceived in a pool. Susie, you killed Ma Khan, just wait, you will regret it. Suddenly, he heard an explosion sound in the distance, and his expression changed immediately. Why is someone coming to attack the territory at this time? Giant crocodile outside the collar. Fatty Wong asked his dwarves to keep waving magic cannons. Constantly bombarding the unknown territory. Strange, why didn't the lord show up for so long, did he go out? That's just right, capture the centaur and leave. Although Fatty Wong felt strange, he didn't care. This broken city wall was finally blasted open. Through the broken walls, when Fatty Wong saw the tight female centaurs inside, his face was full of joy. Dot dot dot, leader, lord lord, please don't kill us, we are willing to surrender. Susie brought all the heroes who had been promoted to the 8th rank to the sky above the original territory. In the open space below, there are hundreds of cat people in made outfits. Wrong, 
It's a cat girl. Susie glanced around in surprise and found that all the cat people here were female. Actually, Susie didn't know. At the beginning, Makin was tricked into coming to Dashi Desert by the attribute of cat girl. The people here, general weakness, because they cannot fight with other races, they can only survive in the remote Boulder Desert. When I first came here, these cat people are all with yellow skin and haggard complexions. He didn't look interested, kill all the male cat people directly, leaving some female cat people with good foundation. As a result, it has only been raised for a few days. Finally raised white and clean. But he died in the hands of Susie, making Susie easier for nothing. Susie looked at the cat girl below but fell into deep thought. He undoubtedly liked these cat girls. But after seeing Shen Liu's skills just now, an idea popped up in his mind. If Shen Liu is allowed to brainwash these cat girls, form a crazy worship of yourself. If that is the case, will the power of faith increase rapidly? If so, the speed at which Susie acquires the power of faith will once again increase by leaps and bounds. Thinking of this, Susie wanted Shen Liu to try it on the cat girls below. However, just then, the four heroes of Suzy suddenly looked to the west in unison. My lord, a creature with a strong breath is coming. Xiao Ju flew up to Suzy and said vigilantly. Suzy straightened his expression and immediately stopped caring about catgirls. Looking into the distance, he suddenly looked dignified. Far away, okay okay. A golden behemoth with a size of a kilometer, covering the sky and the sun, is striding towards them. Suzy, I finally found you. Han Li burst into laughter when he saw Su Zi. Not far away, two figures, one large and one small, also appeared on a boulder. Sister Yunur, is that your fiancé? What a huge monster! Bai Mengmeng looked at Han Li who was sitting on the thousand-meter giant beast and couldn't help swallowing her saliva. Compared to, she's not even a little girl. Chu Yuyan nodded, her expression was calm and expressionless. Family marriage, they haven't met much, let alone have any relationship. No, Sister Yunur, look quickly, he seems to be heading towards Highness Suzy. They won't fight, will they? Thinking of this, little Lolita became excited instantly. I don't know which one is stronger, His Royal Highness Suzy or Han Li. In the sky, Suzy was far away from the figure standing on the head of the golden behemoth. Staring at the golden behemoth in front of him, his eyes showed surprise. The height of a kilometer, the weight of tens of thousands of tons. Really a giant, the two long crescent teeth on the side of the mouth seem to penetrate everything, which are seven to eight hundred meters long. Sharp, sharp, glaring. Two huge arms support the huge body, stand upright. With golden hair, like a living god. There was a terrifying aura all over his body. Susie saw such a huge creature for the first time, and it was many times more terrifying than the Zerg and from its breath, it is undoubtedly the existence of the ninth level. It's no wonder that the man named Han Li came here on this golden beamin alone. Suzy used identification on the golden beamin. Open black lens bracket golden beamin close black lens bracket. Race. Beamin. Quality. Legendary. Heroic. Grade. 88. Physique. 9 million. Agility. 5.6 million. Spirit. 7 million. Skills. Beam and Roar, Landslide, Ground Crack, Gravity Field, Earth Sprint. Introduction. This is an invincible behemoth, be careful with its fangs. The strength is very strong. After reading it, Suzy made a comment. Ninth level, the lowest agility is 5.6 million. Even more terrifying is the physique. There are 9 million. Basically, it stands at the peak of heroes of all arms. Suzy, are these your units? I really don't know how you won the first place in the trial. Han Li saw several heroes in front of Su Zi. A piece of grass, a strange white-headed tree, a willow, and finally a small flower bud. Compared with his thousand-meter behemoth, Su Zi's hero units are like ants. Not even one foot bigger than his gold. It seems that there is no need to explain to you. Su Zi frowned. He confirmed that he didn't know this person, but it seemed that he came here specially for him. Behemoth looks terrifying, but Suzy is not afraid. Do you really think Big is powerful? Joke, Nine Leaf Sword Grass told him to be a man every minute. Suzy, do you dare to compete with me? Standing on top of the Behemoth Behemoth, 
Han Li's eyes were red, and he challenged Su Zi. He wants to fight with Su Zi. Let's see who is worthy of the first place in the trial. He wanted Lord Vermilion Bird to see who is qualified to be her disciple. Why should I compare with you? Su Zi thinks there is something wrong with this person. He did not hesitate to come all the way, just to fight with him. No good thing. Why should I fight you? Han Li frowned. I feel that Su Zi doesn't have the courage to be His Royal Highness, and he doesn't even dare to accept the challenge. But he doesn't want to care so much. Eyes cold. He just wants to compete with Su Zi. Since you don't want to fight with me, I will force you to fight. If you don't compete with me today, then you don't want to leave. After Han Li finished speaking, he flew directly into the sky. I want Jin Beeman to teach Su Zi a lesson. Wait, stop fighting. You know how to fight all day long, and everyone is led by Vermilion Bird, so can't you fight against the White Tiger League together? Suddenly, a crisp and pleasant voice came from a distance. Su Zi looked towards the voice and felt shocked immediately. Two beautiful girls who are coming from afar. One in front and one in back, one small and one large. The former is a little short in stature, but his skin is crystal clear, a pair of small hands, just right on his small waist, pink lips slightly curled up. Wearing black short sleeves and black silk suspenders on the legs. A feeling of a dark little lily spread across the surface. The latter is a girl with a slender figure, exquisite appearance, and plain clothes, with a calm and indifferent face. No joy can be seen, the demeanor is gentle and elegant, and there is a feeling of being a lady. The two come together, then he stood directly between Suzy and Han Li. Suzy wondered, why are there two beauties again? Judging from his words, it seems that it was also led by Vermilion Bird. Is the dashy desert so attractive? Seems to see Su Zi's doubts. Bai Meng Meng hummed to Su Zi twice, waved her fist and said to Su Zi. Su Zi, my name is Bai Meng Meng, the leader of Vermilion Bird's Bai family, remember, don't forget. Otherwise I will kill you. Her name is Chu Yuyan, she is the head of the Chu family of Vermilion Bird, by the way, she is also that guy's fiancé, don't make any plans for her. Bai Mengmeng, Chu Yuyan. Su Zi glanced at the two girls. I feel that the personalities of these two AGDI are quite different. Chu Yuyan nodded slightly at him. Then she stood quietly without speaking, and did not intend to talk to her fiancé. Chu Yuyan, don't stand in front of me, or I'll beat you too. Han Li said angrily when he saw the two people standing in front of him. He came all the way here. The purpose is to prove that he is better than Su Zi, but now his fiancé actually stops him. It made him feel angry. Han Li, do you dare to try? Others are afraid of you, but I am not afraid of you. When Bai Meng Meng heard this, she immediately raised the white rabbit in her hand like a little hedgehog with fried fur. Han Li's face was dark when he heard this, and he looked at the rabbit in Bai Meng Meng's hand full of fear. Lunar Jade Rabbit the top class of legendary arms. Holding the terrifying power of frost, it is enough to seal ten things. Even he did not dare to underestimate Bai Mengmeng. Su Zi was watching the play on the sidelines, not in a hurry. Just admiring the two beauties. Chu Yuyan glanced at him. I feel a little strange. This highness is too calm. It seemed that Han Li wasn't paying attention at all. Does he have any cards? Su Zi, what do you need to fight with me? With Bai Mengmeng blocking him, Han Li was a little unwilling. A fight, in fact, Su Zi doesn't care about fighting or not. The key is that fighting without any attention is a waste of energy. He thought for a while, and glanced at Chu Yuyan, wanting Han Li to back down. So he said lightly, your fiancé is good, if you bet on her, I don't mind. Hearing this, everyone present shrank their pupils. Never expected Su Zi to make such a request. Su Zi, I misread you. I didn't expect you to be this kind of person. Bai Mengmeng yelled angrily. Chu Yuyan also frowned slightly, a little displeased, but she looked at Han Li, wondering how he would reply. Han Li was furious when he heard the words, and wanted to scold Su Zi severely. Su Zi dared to hit his fiancé's mind. But suddenly it occurred to him. This is not an opportunity. Anyway, he won't lose. If you win Su Zi, Maybe you will be valued by Master Vermilion Bird. Chu Yuyan is just a woman. It is good. Han Li nodded heavily and agreed. Su Zi. He was just joking. I hope he can get out of trouble. 
What does Han Li mean? Bai Meng Meng's eyes widened even more, and she turned to look at Han Li. That's his fiance. How can it be used as a bet? Chu Yuyan clenched her beautiful fist hidden in her cuff. I am even more displeased with this fiance. Outside world. On the Great Hall of Vermilion Bird. A huge mirror is showing the picture of Suzy and the others at this time. Now this young man is spending too much time playing. His fiance can be the master. Lord Vermilion Bird couldn't help complaining when he saw this. The gods of the Chu family below looked very ugly, and looked at the gods of the Han family with unkind eyes. The patriarch of the Han family also felt that he couldn't hold back his face. Can only pretend not to see. In his heart, it was almost the same as what Han Li thought. He didn't think Han Li would lose. Suzy, don't you want Chu Yuyan? That's great. Let's try it out. Han Li proudly said. In order to compete with Suzy, he even brought out his fiancée. I don't believe Suzy can still refuse. Han Li, you shameless bastard, you actually bet on your fiancée, do you still want to show some face? Bai Meng Meng yelled angrily, pointed at Han Li and cursed. But Han Li was unmoved, and only looked at Suzy. Chu Yuyan frowned, she who was calm in one item was a little angry at this moment. She has always obeyed the family arrangements, even if she is asked to marry a young master of the Han family whom she does not know. To repay the family's years of nurturing grace, she didn't say anything either. After all, the family has been kind to her in nurturing her. But such a person who ruthlessly takes his fiancé as a bet. Would she still dare to marry him? She couldn't help but feel a little disappointed. Sorry, I was just joking, I didn't expect him to take it seriously. Suzy slightly apologized to Chu Yuyan. Vetoed the bet. Although Chu Yuyan gave him a gentle and quiet feeling. But he wouldn't bet on a girl. It's a good thing you said it fast, or I'll blow you up. Hearing this, Bai Meng Meng raised her pink lips and waved her small fist at Suzy. With such a cute appearance, people couldn't help holding her in their arms and ravaging her vigorously. Suzy smiled slightly at her. This little lowly is adorable, with a witty and quirky appearance, very suitable to be a pistachio. Seeing Suzy staring at her and smiling, Bai Meng Meng's handsome cheeks made her feel flustered. Secretly shocked, could it be that he gave up Sister Yunur in order to get my idea? No, although he is handsome, I don't like him. Bai Meng Meng stuck out her pink tongue, pulled down her lower right eyelid, and made a grimace at Suzy. No, suddenly, a tender shout resounded through the world. People look. Chu Yuyan changed her usual demure look, stared at Zi with piercing eyes and said. The bet has been made, how can it be easily changed? Could it be that His Highness doesn't like me, Chu Yuyan? Chu Yuyan's attitude is firm. There is an attitude that if you dare to refuse, I will never die. Su Zi was slightly stunned, looking at Chu Yuyan with a puzzled expression. I don't know what this girl is up to. He naturally wouldn't think that Chu Yuyan had taken a fancy to him. But when she saw the dissatisfaction with Han Li in Chu Yuyan's eyes, suddenly, is this because I want to take revenge on Han Li? A wicked smile appeared on the corner of Su Zi's mouth, and he faintly threatened, Miss Chu, you should think clearly, if I agree, you will be mine from now on. He wanted to scare Chu Yuyan. Seeing Su Zi's smile, Chu Yuyan's heart skipped a beat for no reason, feeling a little bad. He hoped to use Su Zi to contain Han Li. But it seems that Su Zi, the hungry wolf, really has bad thoughts about her. My mind turned sharply, and I bowed slightly. If you really can win against Han Li, I will be your man. I, Chu Yuyan, promise a thousand gold, and I will never go back on my word. Chu Yuyan said calmly, with a bearish look. In fact, he has already started to think of ways to escape. She didn't expect to come this trip, and now she almost lost herself. Thinking that all of this was brought up by Su Zi. Can't help but give Su Zi a reproachful look. Su Zi raised his eyebrows, slightly surprised. Chu Yuyan winked at him in front of his fiancée. I secretly said in my heart. The girl seemed to be calm and relaxed, but she didn't expect her heart to be so passionate and unrestrained. Han Li frowned, unhappy in his heart. After all, Chu Yuyan is also his fiancé in name. When he wins Su Zi, Chu Yuyan will still be his fiancé. But seeing Chu Yuyan and Su Zi flirting, he felt as if he was wearing a green hat on his head. 
Then try it. Hearing this, Su Zi took a deep look at Chu Yuyan. Then it rose into the sky and stood in the void. Xiao Ju led the three heroes and directly surrounded Golden Behemoth. See, Bai Mengmeng and Chu Yuyan also left immediately. There must be a big battle next. A ninth level Golden Bimin, its destructive power even the gods would tremble for it. Every blow is enough to destroy the world. Sister Yunur, do you really plan to go with Su Zi if he wins? Bai Mengmeng, who was hiding behind a boulder in the distance, asked Chu Yuyan. She admired Sister Yunur in her heart. Don't look at the usual quiet appearance, but in fact the passion is like fire in the heart. Whoever marries and returns home will die of absolute happiness. Like that sentence. A slut on the bed, a lady under the bed. Her sister Yunur can make people want to die. How is this possible? Chu Yuyan shook her head, a hint of playfulness flashed in her eyes. When they fight inextricably, we will slip away quietly. Oh, as expected of sister Yunur, what about the White Tiger League? We can't beat them. Once the world battlefield opens, if we don't form a group, we will be beaten badly. Bai Mengmeng suddenly remembered the purpose of their visit. Chu Yuyan's mouth froze. I was so angry just now, I forgot about it. She can't go yet. Wrong. Who said Su Zi must win? What if he loses? Then wouldn't he have to fulfill the bet, and then find a way to cancel the engagement after going out? After all, they don't know Su Zi's combat power. Being strong in trials doesn't necessarily mean being a hero. On the combat power of a single hero. In addition to hero arms such as dragons, titans, angels, etc. It may be difficult for others to compete with Golden Behemoth. After all, the Golden Behemoth clan is a race that claims to be able to single out gods. In this competition, it is very difficult for Suzy to win. Suzy doesn't know about other people's opinion but he is always full of confidence in his hero. Although Xiao Ju is only at the 8th level, all attributes have already reached the peak of a 9th level hero. As Su Zi said, Xiao Ju's message appeared in front of his eyes. Open black lens bracket 9 leaf sword grass close black lens bracket. Race, plant, quality, supreme. Grade, 79, bloodline, 9 leaf sword grass. Talent, practice the sword to become stronger. Physique. 9.99 million agility 9.99 million spirit 9.99 million skills sword shadow sword drawing sword jew cross cut continuous cut seven tribulations sword technique loyalty 100 percent permanent intro hack him if you're not a god your battle power won't exceed tens of millions seeing the various attributes of the supreme sword grass suzy said to himself this is the experience of the lords of the 940 world for hundreds of millions of years. Xiao Ju is only at the 8th rank now and is about to pass the 9th rank. There is still a long way to go before becoming a 100 level deity. But its various attributes have already reached the top of the mundane. If we take advantage of this battle, kill Golden Behemoth, Xiao Ju has a high possibility of being promoted to the 9th rank. I don't know if there is a chance to break the curse of hundreds of millions of years. And, there are three supportive heroes who have just been promoted to the 8th rank beside Xiao Ju. Kumoshu, Shenliu, Paraspor. Each one is invincible at the same level, against the existence of the 9th level. Su Zi couldn't possibly lose. And Han Li's eyes are full of confidence. Since his golden bimin was born, it took him endless efforts to cultivate it to the 9th level. The strength is below the gods, it can be described as the top. Thinking, he looked up. It seems to see many gods watching here from the sky. He glanced at Su Zi. Nowadays, then knock you off the altar. Vermilion bird collar, under the watchful eyes of many gods. They are also full of curiosity about this battle. In the end, the disciple of His Highness Vermilion Bird will win, or the Han family's charming son will win. Although they have also seen Suzy take a shot a few times, they have never seen him make a shot every time. They also want to see. How does Plant Hero compare to other departments? My Wu Qingying's disciple, how could it be worse than others? Wu Qingying is full of confidence in Suzy. She has seen Suzy's methods. Naturally know the strength of Suzy heroes. But she has never seen Suzy do his best, and every time it is a crushing battle. I hope that Golden Behemoth can try his confidence. 
Susie, I hope you will do your best, otherwise your hero will die here, don't blame me. Hong Lee reminded, you sure, I don't want to win without fighting. It is good. Suzy nodded and gave orders to the four heroes. Let them use all their strength directly. Received orders. Xiao Ju's sword leaf trembled slightly. There was a look of sarcasm on the terrifying face of Pumashu. The green branches of the willow flutter in the wind. The flower buds with little parasitic spores seem to be ready to burst out. Next moment, before everyone has passed the gods, the four heroes moved directly. The magic catfish tree swayed the dandelions all over the sky, like white raindrops. In an instant, it took root on the fur of the giant beast and began to absorb energy crazily. Golden Behemoth felt as if there were countless ants all over his body. While sucking his blood, his muscles, even his soul ached. Roar, he couldn't help roaring in pain, shaking his huge body, trying to shake off those white dandelions. The ground was crushed and collapsed. What happened? This scene made everyone confused. Why did Golden Behemoth suddenly go crazy? Chu Yuyan looked at the dandelion that was still falling, her pupils shrank. Dandelion can also drive Golden Beeman crazy. Not to be outdone, Shen Liu flew directly over Biman's head, and all the willow branches emitted divine light. For a while, Golden Behemoth actually stopped the riot, but he seemed to have lost his soul. The huge eyes are drooping, and there is no trace of life. But deep down in his soul, he is still resisting. The parasitic spores sprinkled countless spores in an instant, and melted into the body of Golden Behemoth without hindrance. Gold Behemoth, who was still struggling, completely collapsed to the ground. Han Liren is stupid, I don't understand why it suddenly became like this. Impossible, Golden Behemoth is a hero that even Shendu dares to challenge. How could he lose to a group of plants? Stand up, Golden Beeman. Stand up for me, Han Li roared. It's a pity that Golden Behemoth has been completely controlled now, and he doesn't listen to him at all. Sister Yanur, I don't think we can go anymore. Suddenly, Bai Mengmeng tugged on Chu Yuyan's skirt, staring at her big eyes. She knew that Suzy would be strong, but this is too perverted. That's Golden Beeman, the real top legendary unit which claims to be able to compete with the gods, and even grow enough to kill the gods. But all in less than a minute. Directly controlled by four, no, three plant systems. Not even a trace of resistance. Is this too exaggerated? Gudong, Chu Yuyan was also dumbfounded, when had she seen this scene before? This has gone beyond common sense. It's not over yet. Xiao Ju, who had been waiting all this time, suddenly moved. A sword intent that wanted to pierce the sky rushed out from Xiaoju's body. Next moment, a hundreds of meters long sword condensed in the void. The long sword is composed of sword energy. A fierce aura emanated from his whole body, as if he wanted to tear apart the space. Just looking at it from a distance, it feels like the brain is about to be torn apart. Suddenly, the great sword falls, just like opening up the world, breaking the space into fragments directly. The long sword that cuts space. Cut off the head of Golden Behemoth directly. Golden Behemoth stared at a pair of huge eyes, and his eyes were full of disbelief. Invincible him. It hasn't even started yet. He was directly beheaded. For a while, the scene came to a standstill. Only Xiao Ju was surrounded by light. This is the light of evolution. About to enter the ninth level. Sister Yunur, His Royal Highness Suzy is actually pretty good. I don't know how many times stronger than that Han Li, why don't you just follow? Far away, Bai Mengmeng blinked her big bright eyes, turned her head, and persuaded Chu Yuyan who was beside her. If there is a brother-in-law like Su Zi, then wouldn't she be able to walk sideways in the Tianjiao competition? What White Tiger League? FK them. Thanks for watching, please like and subscribe.